Are there any unconventional sleep tips, the what if kind of things that, you know, what if it turns out that, and I hear I just, I, I've got a blank there for you to fill in. The first one, which is unconventional along the lines of naps, if you've had a bad night of sleep, do nothing. What I mean by that is don't wake up any later. Don't sleep in the following day to try and make up for it. Don't nap during the day. Don't consume extra caffeine to wake you up, to try to get you through the day. And don't go to bed any earlier to think that you're going to compensate. If you wake up later, you're not going to be sleepy until late in the evening. So you're going to go to bed at your normal time and you won't be sleeping. You'll think, well, I just came off a bad night of sleep and now I, I still I'm, I can't even get to sleep and it's my normal time. It's because you slept in later than you would otherwise and re you reduce the window of adenosine accumulation before your normal bedtime. So don't go, don't wake up any later. Don't use more caffeine for the reasons that, that are obvious, because that's only going to crank you and keep you awake the following night or decrease the probability of a good following night of recovery sleep. And then finally, don't go to bed any earlier. Resist and resist and go to bed at your normal time. What I want to try and do is prevent you from thinking, well, I had such a bad night last night and I normally go to bed at 1030. I'm just going to get into bed at nine o'clock. 